UFTB has figured out how to pay Terrence Budrick Crawford. Bud fans can do it. Let's talk. Straighter, yep, yep, not yep. roundhouse right hand. And that's what we've been talking about, the straight shot. It's exactly. the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull somebody back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now, I want to see you fight, motherfuckers. I do. All right, I'm with you. I'm with you. As long as, as, long as you're trying to fight the great, the, your, or the, the, the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Fight the best if you ain't with the moto. Just click the link, bitch, and get buried like the rest. It ain't gonna work how you want it. These trolls already tried, too many come but don't leave. So if you're here, you gotta die. Spitting straight facts. These bitches cry cause they hate that. The LDBC's the top topic, bitch. Hate that. Be the best to bring the truth to these fans. So why you hate? I'ma laugh and keep counting these bands. Come to the graveyard. Click the link, get the hands. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. So Terrence Budrick Crawford and his fans have habitually talked about nothing more but this man's pockets. Over and over and over again. It's all I talk about. It's all you ever hear. Oh man, well, you know, he's gotta it's gotta be fair and they gotta do it and they gotta pay. Well, I have been saying over and over and over again the exact same thing. Consistently, habitually, the same thing that the networks are saying. Bro, you guys say this is a big fight. That's what y'all do. Y'all are oh, it's the biggest fight in boxing. I think this fight is a hundred million or blah blah blah. Yada yada yada. Five hundred billion. I think it's a, it's going to do better than everybody else. Man, Terry Crawford, the biggest draw in the sport of boxing. And blah blah blah. Okay, fine, no problem. The networks say you guys don't buy his pay per views. You do not buy his fights. So I am not putting up shit. All right, I I will put up enough money, three hundred fifty thousand, because that's what I I know I'll be able to make. I can maybe push 400,000. I can push 400,000 and say, that's what I believe we're going to make for this fight. 400,000 pay-per-view buys. Okay, well, the numbers will say I have X amount of dollars for that. If this motherfucker, if you want more than that, I'm not doing it. It's not happening. I'm not doing it. Any smart network will not do that. Because you guys don't buy his pay-per-views. Bob Aaron blatantly said the man don't sell. I've been losing money on everything, and Bob has been paying this man a guarantee. Yet you motherfuckers say, oh, we got to get a guarantee. Give him a guarantee, man. That's why I just got to give him a guarantee. Oh, it's crazy, man. He ain't getting no guarantee. Oh, man, ain't no fight. Never happened in the history of boxing. The history of mankind. Ain't no fight happened. These guys didn't get a guarantee. This is crazy. Blah, blah, blah. I'm knowing y'all are full of shit. Because the fighters in the old days that you guys, uh, um, Dick Rise, oh man, this ain't like the old days, man. In the old days, ain't nobody care about no O. And our bar, all they cared about is the fight. It's the best fight to buy. All they cared about. Yeah, but they fought so many times because they were not getting paid. They were making pennies. That's why they had to keep fighting. Facts. All right? Terrence Crawford is making millions of dollars. But yet you got no, ain't enough. No, no, he's his family starving. There's um African flies just buzzing around this man's belly and his baby's belly and stuff. Cause he's starving. He is not starving. That man is filthy fucking rich. But according to you guys, he's got to make way more money, way more. Oh no, what about Earl though? Earl, what about him? The man accepted what they offered. It was Terrence Budrick Crawford who didn't. Facts. They both had transparency. Facts. They both weren't getting a guarantee for the third contract. Facts. Arrow accepted everything. Terrence Crawford claimed he accepted everything, but he didn't sign. And then they'll say, oh, whoa, well, what the hell, BFTB? Well, why didn't Arrow sign it? It was Arrow's contract. Arrow is the one that sent it. Arrow. It was Arrow's contract. 
It was Eros. He wrote it. He orchestrated it. He and his team, and I, and I say he because his team that he pays for did it for him. So it was him. It was his contract. But you fucking weird ass niggas. Oh, listen, bro. All he had to do, why didn't Earl sign it? <laughs> well, why didn't show me Earl's signature on it. I need to see Earl's signature on it. That's the goofiest, dumbest shit I've ever heard in my life. But yet, that's what y'all do, guys. Y'all do it in a heartbeat. <laughs> y'all do it in a heartbeat, bro. You'll do it in a heartbeat. Insanity. Fucking insanity. Let me explain something to you guys. If the originator of the contract creates it, they're the originator. They wrote it. They do not write it and sign it and send it to you. That's not how contracts work. You are the guy. I'm fine with it because I'm, I'm writing it. I'm fine. It is you. I'm sending it to you. I'm sending it to the B side. The B side needs to be appeased. The B side needs to be pleased. The B side needs to sign it. When the B side signs it, I wrote it. It's my contract. I wrote it for you. I'm the A side. So because I wrote it for you, then you sign it first. When you sign it and send it back to me, I will sign it. I wrote it. It's mine. I know what's in it. I am not going to create a contract that I don't know if you're going to sign, sign it and send it to you. It's the dumbest shit in the world. And that is not how contracts work. They do not work that way at all. The originator, the creator of it, sends it. Once the B-side, the acceptor, accepts it and signs it, then it comes back to me. That's how that works. Whatever. But I know y'all have run off some nonsense about all this other stuff, but whatever. It, it, irrelevant. Irrelevant. Unless The only way that doesn't happen that way is if you guys have already agreed, you already agree it's a rematch or a trilogy or, a, or whatever, but y'all already agreed in the first fight of that there's going to be a second fight. Then it doesn't matter who the fuck signs it first because y'all already agreed that y'all going to fight the second one. Y'all already have it in the contract of the first fight that you're going to have the second one. And if you have it in the contract of the second one, then it doesn't matter who signs the first or last in the third one. It doesn't matter because it's already in the previous contract. It's already written there. So it doesn't matter who signs it when. That is totally irrelevant. It only matters when it is the originator of the contract, the very first one. It's all that's the, that's when it matters. Any other time it doesn't. But whatever. I figured out a way for Terrence Crawford fans who claim they're fans to pay Terrence Crawford. Go fund me. Start a GoFundMe for Terrence Budger Crawford. Ask that man. What does he want? Terrence Budrick Crawford, what do you, because you guys running around here claiming that's the fight y'all want. Oh, that's the fight that we want, oh, man. It's, oh, it's crazy. Let's pay that man, pay that man. And I keep telling you guys, bro, the networks ain't paying this man because he don't sell. Fine. So what we can do is all the Budrick fans start a GoFundMe for Terrence Budrick Crawford and put money in it. Pay this man's purse. What the problem is. Put your money where your fucking mouth is. Yeah. Oh, man, Al Haney to pay him. Al Haney. Well, you pay him. It's a fight you want, right? You pay him then. Money matters. He's got to get paid, right? So go pay him. It don't got to be on pay-per-view. Or maybe it can. Tell that man, listen, bro. Take 20%. Take an 80-20 split. Because we're paying you what you want. You don't care about that. All you care about is guarantees. How much money do you want? How much money do you want? You want what? 10 million? That's what you want? You want 10 million? What do you want? 15 million? All right. We'll start a GoFundMe for 15 million. Hell, he knows Warren Buffett. Warren Buffett can pay for that himself. The magical, mysterious hedge fund can pay for it themselves. They can just go right in there and just drop the 15 million straight in there. Terrence Crawford, you want $15 million? Bam. Hedge fund, uh, 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 go fund me, go met. Congratulations, it's met. There you go. There is your 15 million guarantee. You want 20 million guarantee. Hey, the hedge fund can take you there too. You want 25 million, no problem. The hedge fund can pay for that too. All you gotta do, my goal, Terrence Budrick Crawford, the goal, 
to fight Errol Spence is you need $25 million. There you go. The hedge fund comes in to the rescue. Bow! Pays your bill. Okay, the, then the negotiations with Errol Spence are extremely easy. They're extremely easy. Give me 20% of the back end. We don't got to worry about no guarantees. I'm paid. We don't got to worry about nothing, bro. I don't need no transparency. All I need is 20% of the back end. That's all I need. That's it. Hey, those, those, that, those numbers cannot be, it's in, you can write in a contract. Write in a contract. You sue niggas. Yeah, you ain't got no problem with suing people. You sue Bob Errol. Let, turn, let Errol Spence and the PBC not give you your full back end bread. Sue that man. It won't cost you a dime. You already have lawyers in your payroll. And you can put into the lawsuit the lawyer fees. So you don't have to pay nothing. Nothing. You can go on with your life. You can beat Errol Spence like you guys claim he'll do. He'll knock Errol Spence out. Fine. Now you're the undisputed champion. If you don't get the full, you got your guaranteed upfront money, your $25 million guarantee from that hedge fund or from Terrence Crawford fans. They claim y'all fans. Y'all claim y'all want it. Y'all claim y'all. Oh, I support black business. I support black business until it's time to buy his pay-per-views. You support black business until it's time to buy the pay-per-view. Okay, well, you can do it up front. You can put your money where your mouth is up front. That way, no one's going to say, oh, well, Charles Crawford's the one that sold this fight. Oh, Earl Spencer's the one that sold No, 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 no. You get it all up front. This is a GoFundMe for Terrence Budrick Crawford for his guarantee. A Terrence Budrick Crawford GoFundMe for his guarantee. Is, it, it shouldn't take long. For all these weird ass bud dick riders all over the world. Yeah, all over the world. Y'all, hey, y'all can y'all can contribute. You can contribute to the GoFundMe. You sure can. You can contribute to the GoFundMe. All you motherfucking weird ass dudes are running around here talking about how much he should get and how the PBC is broke and Al Heyman needs to do this and Al Heyman needs to do that. Well, if you're saying what someone needs to do, then you do it. Let's just see how fast he gets to 25 million. I guarantee you that bitch will sit on five dollars for the next five years because y'all niggas don't buy his pay-per-views y'all don't buy nothing he does i don't see you niggas running around here with tbc hats and shirts i don't see none of that shit the only thing i see is terrence crawford thumbnails because them shits are free <laughs> i don't see any of you niggas wear or terrence crawford shirts none of y'all niggas with terrence crawford hats y'all have thumbnails on youtube on fake pages yeah because you could just go steal those those are free you could just get those from anywhere. You go right to this man's Facebook and steal his thumbnail and make a whole new page. <laughs> now put your money where your mouth is. Start a GoFundMe to get this man's guarantee bag. Since y'all claiming he needs to get a guarantee. Y'all are so worried about this man's pockets. Oh, man, he got to get paid. It's crazy, man. This man's starving, man. His family is dying, man. They ain't, they, man, these family, they, they got tuberculosis, a per purpleosis, a pocket from them. Them niggas got, man, they need them. They got AIDS. Uh, they need everything. They need AZT, man. Them niggas got all they on pills. They, they need everything. They need everything. Okay, well, fine. We'll, we'll pay it then. Pay it. Start a GoFundMe. Put your money where your mouth is. Show the world what it's all about. There is plenty of you guys who can do it. There is plenty of y'all. Plenty of y'all can start a GoFundMe for Terrence Budrick Crawford's guarantee bag. I mean, that's your boy, right? You could you could talk to him, right? You can contact him. Well, I mean, unless you are a black YouTuber. <laughs> if you're not a black YouTuber, you ain't talking to that. Hey, I mean, if you're a black YouTuber, you ain't talking to him. If you're a black person, good luck. But, I mean, maybe y'all can contact Akin Barak, maybe, or... Shit, I don't know. Maybe y'all can contact that that uh, one white lady, whoever she was. Or maybe y'all can get a hold of Max Kellerman. Maybe these guys give a fuck about your existence. And you can say, hey, I'm Dildo Goofus Troll Boy. And I am starting a GoFundMe for Terrence Budrick Crawford. Can you please reach out to him and ask him um, to take his SB coat off and see how much money does he want to fight Errol Spence? Because... We're going to start a GoFundMe campaign to get his guarantee for Errol Spence. Since the networks won't pay for it. No network. <laughs> no network. Zero networks are paying 
for Errol Spence and Terrence Crawford. Zero. Not one. Nobody. For the biggest fight in the sport of boxing. <laughs> yeah, but they'll pay for Errol by himself, but they won't pay for Terrence Budger Crawford. Why? Because Budrick don't sell. Oh, BLK is paying for him. BLK, yeah, because BLK is an upstart. And as an upstart, you need to break the bag as an upstart. That's how the zone was. The zone should have broke the bag. I told y'all this already. They should have broke the bag on Tank, broke the bag on Arrow, broke the bag on uh, on on uh, Deontay. They should have broke the bag on those guys. They already had Dev. They should have broke the bag to get the biggest fighters on their platform. BLK is breaking the bag to get Budrick. This is an extremely big risk. Extremely. He is not going to recover $10 million. He is not going to recover uh, eight figures. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. In order for him to recover, for BLK to recover eight figures, they will need Errol Spence. They need Errol Spence. They will not recover this, him fighting anybody else. I wish him well. But I, I know what it is. That's the reason why um, Top Rank and ESPN didn't do it. That's the reason why uh, DAZN didn't do it. That's the reason why um, Fox, Showtime, PBC are like, hey, man, this is all we got for you. That's the reason why BT and Show Sports and, um, and Sky Sports and nobody else is doing anything, putting up no funds, doing nothing, because he don't sell. That's why. He does not sell. But if you guys run around here claiming all this shit that y'all claiming, no problem. Start your GoFundMe for Terrence Budger Crawford's guarantee and you pay for it. I bet you you won't. I bet you. And I bet you if somebody does start it, it will stay on $5 for the next five years. BFTB. Shout out to the mighty. Mighty. L-D-B-C, and I'm out.